Well, after playing 11 in the past 13 on the road, the Griffins are finally back home to uh, play eight straight here at Van Andel Arena starting tonight against Manitoba. And of course, considering we live in this phenomenal city, playing this great arena and have the best fans in the American Hockey League, naturally Griffins players are excited to be back. Oh, absolutely. Um, you know, we've been on the road what feels like forever now, but finally we're back home and get to play in front of our home crowd and it should be a fun night. Yeah, 100 percent. You know, being on the road that long, it's always tough. And, uh, you know, our records su suffered a little bit because of it. And it's been tough travel. And uh, I think getting back home, getting our getting our wheels underneath us and, you know, being able to rest a little bit in our own beds and stuff like that's going to going to help us down the stretch. Well, the Griffins actually had some good success going 6-4 and 1 in those 11 road games. Now they got to figure out a way to break this losing streak at home and no doubt getting both Moritz Sider and Joe Valeno back from the World Junior Championships is going to help. They'll be in the lineup tonight. Both performed extremely well on the world stage, especially Valeno winning a gold medal with Team Canada. They come back with a ton of confidence. Yeah, it feels great. Obviously, it's a uh, you know, once-in-a-lifetime opportunity and uh, you know to finish it off with a gold medal means a lot. And uh, coming back here with a lot of confidence for sure, playing big minutes over there with uh, big responsibility. So, uh, you know, I'm going to try to bring as much as I could uh, to Grand Rapids and uh, play my best hockey here. For sure. I mean, it was a great opportunity playing a lot of minutes, uh, playing the PP, PK, uh, leading over all the teams. So I was, I was very excited, but also I'm very excited to be back. Well, there's more great news for the Griffins as Michael Rasmussen, another of the Wings' first-round draft picks, has been out since November the 12th with injury. He, too, returns to the Griffins' lineup tonight. Yeah, for sure. Uh, it's been tough. I wouldn't call it a waste of two months, but um, definitely to get healthy, it's important. and um, It's definitely not been the easiest on me, but um, I'm back and I'm, and I'm ready to go and ready to help the team, so I'm um, just looking forward to it. Well, in all, there'll be 10 first-round draft picks playing in the game tonight, seven for Grand Rapids and three for Manitoba. This will be the fifth meeting of the year between these two clubs. The Griffins claim victory in the first head-to-head -head matchup. The Moose have won the last three. These two teams, by the way, are part of a six-team logjam in the Central Division standings from third to eighth place, separated by just four points. Calvin Pickard will get the start and goal for Grand Rapids tonight. Remember Eric Comrie? He was claimed off waivers by the Red Wings earlier this year from the Winnipeg Jets, played three games with Detroit, and then uh, Wings tried to send him to Grand Rapids, well, Winnipeg reclaimed him. He's now with their AHL affiliate. These Manitoba Moose and will start against Grand Rapids tonight. Thanks for joining us, everybody. Great to be home. Have a good time tonight and be safe if you're out and about this evening and throughout this weekend.